My name is Francois Nasser. I lead sales here with Digital Solutions at HCL Software. I'm here to talk to you about Domino V11 licensing. This is our first step in our journey in license simplification for HCL Digital Solutions software. The current license challenge we have with Notes and Domino are specifically around the PVU Cal and authorized user model. It's complex. It requires multiple product line items for entitlement. It does not align with how organizations are buying software today. It requires specialized tooling to measure compliance such as ILMT, and is not in line with modern containerization strategies. Changes in customers' hardware and infrastructure impacts licensing count and cost, making renewals unpredictable. To that end, we would like to introduce you to the new Domino V11 licensing model. It is a per-user model, per model available as a term license or a perpetual license. The idea behind it is that it needs to be simple. It's based on business use. It does not require server and hardware information to measure. It's transparent. It has FlexNet built into the product, which will automatically count the number of users for you and report it to you. There will be no audits required. It provides you the ability to deploy an unlimited number of servers, even in a containerized architecture. It is aligned with how you buy software today with only one install kit instead of multiple. And last but not least, you can know exactly what your costs will be based on the size of your organization. The Domino Utility Server model will still be available for extranet web application access. Our goal is a smooth transition to the new licensing model with a cost neutral to current customers. The way this is gonna work is for current customers today, they will continue with their current licensing until expiration. Yes, they are entitled to download V11 today with their current licensing model and can add capacity under the current model. At renewal time, for customers on the PVU and Cal model, they will be shifted to the per user perpetual model. The same will apply for customers on the CEO licensing model. They will also be shifted to the per user perpetual model without all the requirements of the CEO model. For customers on dual entitlement, which are already on term licenses, they will be moved to the per user term licensing model. Last but not least, the Domino Utility Server model still remains unchanged. For new and expired customers coming back to Domino, they will only have the term license available. A perpetual license model will be available for government and regulated customers that are unable to buy term licenses. Last but not least, the Domino Utility Server will still be available for extranet web application access. This is only the first step in the simpl simplification process. We will continue to work and we'll focus next on the Domino Utility Server licensing model, which is still PVU-based, the mail-only licensing model, as well as the other related products, such as the Enterprise Integrator, the SAP Connector, and other add-ons. We're also working on an unlimited enterprise licensing model to help customers de-risk growth within their organization. Thank you very much and have a great day.